And during an earthquake, great fun, great thrills. You've done the movie thing. Now it's time to move up to the real thing. So that machine, that machine can solve a Rubik's Cube. Yeah. Alright, let's try it. <laughs> Ooh, a belt signed by Mike Tyson. Boxing gloves signed by Muhammad Ali. Whoa. Turned upside down so you can see that. Look at this. It's the world's smallest fidget spinner. Let me zoom in so you can try and see it. <laughs> oh, it stinks in here. It smells like fish, obviously. Hardy har har. Stepping back. Whoa. This mirror shows ghosts. I just saw something. Oh, hell no. Such as X-ray vision. Oh, you can see. Oh, look, you can see her under her skirt. <laughs> we just got back to the hotel. I am beat to death. There's a lot of attractions we went to down there in Gatlinburg. It, some of them were pretty lame, to be honest. But um, it was just so crowded. But I, uh, I figured let's read my fortune real quick. Here we go. It says, do you like to lay in bed just to rest your sleepy head? That's okay for a day or two, but it's a habit which we'll never do. If you don't want to have too many regrets in your life, get up early. Get there first and success will come to you instead uh, of the next fellow. You have a very pleasant disposition and you know how to make, it the most, make the most of it. Uh, life for you hasn't been too easy, but I foresee a turn of events that will give you a great deal of happiness. When opportunity comes, grab it and don't let it slip through your fingers. My lucky numbers are 9, 15, 28, 24, 13, and 45. Oh, and that's nice.
I'll hang on to that. I'll put it in my wallet. But anyway, uh, I think... Shut up! I've had it with people today. I've had it. <laughs> but anyway, I, I'm going to end the vlog right here. I'm just exhausted. But um, if you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And also follow me on Twitter and Instagram. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Peace. Hey guys, I know I look tired. I was up late last night trying to upload the vlog because I had some trouble with my computer, but uh, it's early. And uh, today we're, we're going to Memphis. And uh, if you're a traveling vlogger, you know that I hate packing because I gotta pack all this up. Kill me. I'll see you when we get in the car. We're heading to Memphis today and it's gonna be about a six hour drive, so. Ugh. Now I must specify that uh, we're going to Memphis specifically to go to Graceland. I've been wanting to go to Graceland ever since I was a kid. And uh, yeah, the hotel we picked is a Elvis themed hotel and it's owned by Priscilla Presley herself. So that'd be pretty cool. I wanted to go to the top floor to see how high it was. Oh, there's the sign. Yep, pretty high. Before we leave for Memphis, we're going to stop at the Alcatraz Museum, as well as the Pirates show. So, yeah. I just told you the other day at Ripley's that, that some people claim they have the original death mask, and this people, these people got it too. This is Monica Lewinsky's purse. We're going to the serial killer room. Oh, uh, here's John Wayne Gacy. Oh, God. John Wayne Gacy's outfits and original paintings. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. Look, there he signed there. His, his wallet, his leather jacket. Oh, hell, I'm getting out of here. This room's cursed. Charles Manson. This is Charles Manson. This is Charles Manson's guitar. So you're telling me the boss is, so every time he killed somebody, he kept he a, kept he kept, he kept an item from his victim. Yeah, that's true. So there's three here. There's more than that though, right? Oh yeah, there's three of the victims. Oh, freaking, this is his tooth? Yeah. Ed Gein's tooth, the tooth that inspired Texas Chainsaw Massacre. The original leather face. That's crazy. The Unabomber. Whoa. See, there's Jimmy Hoffa. You know, I always make the joke about if there's like a big clutter, I say, you can find Jimmy Hoffa here. I always say that joke. The crime scene. Oh, I can see how a crime has took place in here. So I guess we're going in here now. The morgue. And this one's a lot cleaner. And you got the courtroom over here. Oh damn. Here's here's Casey Anthony. Oh, this is for Kaylee Anthony. Oh, right over here. Al Capone's. Prison cell. Dang. Looks nice. I'm shocked. Oh, here's a, pretty much an average room. See if you can escape. Eh, I'll pass. <laughs> they had to cover the toilet with something so nobody would pee in it. OJ Simpson stuff. Even his truck.
So apparently the goggles I used were the weakest kind. That's, that's, that's fun to hear. So this place is a lot nicer than I thought it was going to be. But it's chaotic. It's chaotic and they sent a bellboy down to take our bags. I felt so weird about it. I couldn't, he, every time I picked up a bag to put it in the cart, he took it from me to put it in there himself. All right, I must specify that this place is owned by Priscilla Presley, but this hotel, which I've showed you, used to be a guest house that Elvis would send other company to. This giant ass house is a guest house. Think about that for a second. Just think about that. Okay guys, so we really overdone ourselves. This is the room. There's a picture of Elvis. Look at the beds. Look at this. I don't know what we got, but look, there's the pool outside. There's the sink. Look at the shower. Dude, I can do, I can run laps in this damn shower. Watch. I've never had a shower this big before. This is insane. But I think, I think right here's where I'm gonna end the vlog, but um, I'll see you guys tomorrow when we go to Graceland. Yeah, there's a bunch of rich people come in here with like thousands of dollars worth of luggage, like multiple bags, and here I come in with a bag with cat hair all over it. <laughs>